Hi guys and welcome to your tarot love messages for twin flame connections. We're going to go ahead and see what the cards predict for you for your twin flame energies here. This is going to be a general reading guys so please just keep that in mind. If you are after personal tarot reading with myself please feel free to reach out and inquire. I will list my email just below the video here. So we'll give the cards a shuffle here and see what's coming up. What messages are coming up for you and your twin flame? Okay, straight away I get a strong message of karmic justice, okay? Your twin flame here may be paying their karmic dues, okay? Especially if your twin flame here has hurt you or they have pained you in the past, pained you, wound you, they've hurt you, you know, if they've done wrong by you, you know, justice and the wheel of fortune is definitely a strong indicator that I am getting that someone here is having to pay their karmic debt, having to pay their karmic dues. The Wheel of Fortune reminds us that, you know, life is made up of ups and downs. This is the natural rhythm of life. And just as the wheel turns, you know, it's it's like it turns and rotates, you know, it's this never-ending cycle. And just as the wheel turns, you know, what was down eventually goes up and it works in reverse. What was up goes down. So for those of you who have been treated if you feel like you've been treated unfairly, poorly, or wrongly by your twin flame here, okay, and if you feel like your twin flame has, you know, they've not given you that emotional support and that love and that attention and that effort that you feel like you deserve, and you feel like, you know, you've invested so much of your time and your energy, and you feel like some of that may have even been wasted, um, I get a strong message that, yeah, your twin flame here is going to pay their dues for the pain and the hurt that they've inflicted upon you. You know, I feel like this is just, it's, it's karma, it's the laws of karma, and karma is, you know, it has everyone's address written down. The same could work in reverse, though. If you're the twin flame here who's been hurting your twin flame energy, then I definitely feel like you might have to pay some karmic debts or karmic dues. This could also be a reference to past life, though. It could mean that your twin flame here in the past, okay? So even if they haven't necessarily hurt you though, in the past, they may have some karmic debts that have accrued and accumulated and they may have, you know, now's the time to sort of clear some of those karmic debts and karmic liabilities and now now's the time to sort of, you know, pay those off. So that's a strong message that I get, okay? Because I feel like it's like the laws of karma are trying to balance out the scales, it's also about consequences, though. The other message that I get is your twin flame here is about to experience the consequences of his or her actions. Or if this is you, then that's, you know, then that's a message for you. Because at the end of the day, when we commit to an action, we also commit to the consequence of that action. And someone here, I feel like, has been carrying out actions a little bit mindlessly without the consideration of how it actually is impacting or affecting their twin flame energy. And I'm getting that someone's consequences are coming back to nip them in the bud here. Okay, so someone here's about to... I don't want to say suffer the consequences of their actions, but I want to say someone here is about to learn that their actions here do have consequences, whatever those may be, okay? And someone, a twin flame here, is about to discover that. Okay, um... I'm seeing that there's going to be some positive developments with regards to you and your twin flame here. I'm seeing that there's going to be some positive developments in the right direction here. Okay? I feel like it's important that you know your twin flame here does keep secrets from you. Or I feel like they do withhold... There's something here that they withhold from you that I feel like you will benefit from knowing this. So it could be that your twin flame here is not being entirely honest with you about, you know, the feelings that they have for you. Or they may not be entirely honest about their situation here, their circumstances... But with the queen of, uh, not the queen, sorry, the high priestess energy here, I'm definitely getting that your, you know, the secrecies here, the secrecies, 
lies perhaps or information that is being mis misled or withheld here so and i feel like that's important for you to know and for a lot of you because she's governed by intuition you kind of intuitively or instinctively already know that but i, I guess it's just confirmation of that right um I did say I did mention I see some positive developments and these positive developments could you know stem as a result from them paying their karmic dues so if they pay off some karmic dues they'll clear their debts there or otherwise you know the consequences of their actions coming back to teach them a lesson um, they may because you know what goes around comes around right this is what the wheel of fortune teaches us and they may be experiencing something that so for example if they hurt you in the past your person may be experiencing your twin flame he may be experiencing similar sort of circumstances and because they you know were placed in the similar circumstances set of circumstances they were able to identify with the emotions or the emotional triggers that you experience or that emotional experience that you had under those circumstances and that's why i feel like this person comes back with a little more understanding a little more awareness and i feel like they're a lot more enlightened or a lot more understanding here so i definitely feel like there's positive developments around their energy or just around your twin flame connection in general here for those of you that haven't heard from your from you know your twin flame, I definitely feel like with the Knight of Pentacles and the Knight of Wands, I feel like there's going to be some communication here. Okay, maybe not right now, but I feel like they have definitely been thinking about communicating or reaching out to you. I feel like there's definitely been you know they've been giving it some thought. They haven't necessarily done that purely because I feel like there's something here that holds them back. Maybe the two of you left on a really uncomfortable or awkward note last time you spoke. Maybe things for whatever reason are up in the air right now. So I feel like your twin flame here is thinking about reaching out and connecting with you. But they're definitely holding themselves back because I feel like they're trying to really think it through. They're trying to think, you know what's the best way to approach you or what's the best way to contact you or if or not you will respond or how you will respond because I'm seeing them giving a lot of thought to you know how they'll make contact with you or how they will communicate with you or even you know where to go from here next because it feels like they're really sitting on it they're really thinking about it for some of you I feel like your twin flame may even like put together compose and orchestrate a text message but not have the confidence to send it off just yet purely because there's something here that holds them back. Obviously, it's them, but there's something else. And I feel like they're, it's because they're a little scared of the way that you guys... Whatever happened between the two of you last time you saw each other made them feel a little bit uncomfortable. Maybe they know that they did wrong by you, or maybe they're scared that you're going to reject them and not be receptive here. So whatever it is, it's definitely you know making them think long and hard here. Um, I like the Sun card here because I feel like this is you know, potential for um, growth and for success here. The sun is a very vibrant kind of energy. There's optimism here. So I definitely feel like there is... I feel like for a lot of you, and this is cycles, right? Notice how the Wheel of Fortune will get a circular... Um, we, we have cycles here is what I'm getting. I feel like for some of you, you're about to enter a possible new cycle with your Twin Flame connection, okay? You could be entering a new cycle, Because I feel like for some of you, there will be contact, there will be communication when the two of you are vibrationally aligned with one another. Okay, so if you guys aren't communicating now, or if you guys, things are a little bit awkward between the two of you, it's because you're in vibrational misalignment with one another. So there'll be potential to connect here because, you know, once you sort of emotionally align with each other or, you know, vibrationally align with each other, I feel like there will be potential to expand on this connection here. And on the energies. Okay, guys. And these are the messages that I have for you. I just want to thank you for watching and listening. Please show your support by subscribing to this channel, liking, sharing. I will be sharing with you more tarot love messages. So stay tuned. Bye for now.